working finally. I streamed. Okay, it's working now. We're good. We good to go. Alright, last time you all finished up a memory where you casually fought a god. Well, demon lord, same thing, right? Um, but Zariel decided to pop in and say hello. And she asked, hey, bitches, would you do what I did? And some of you said no. Some of you said Maybe. Some of you said nothing. Those who said nothing got no benefit, but those who said something uh, got something reflective of that choice. Uh, you then return from the memory to real world where you're in a citadel. And Ari's grandma's like, hey, bitches, grab the sword. Get your brain goop scooped out and change you who you are. And Ari's like, I'll do that. I will do that thing. And so she did. Craig, would you like to tell them what that's like for you? excruciating pain getting your brain scooped out would not recommend it not that she would remember i don't know <laughs> i don't remember you uh saying that that no that, that's, that, a, that's a paraphrase that might have heard one that definitely a paraphrase um i apologize <laughs> that's just fine i thought it was funny um so yeah, um, so Ari takes the sword and um, she holds it in front of her for a bit and um, she turns it and she holds it in two hands so the, the sword point is pointing to the ground and she kneels down and places her forehead against the butt of the hilt, almost like as if she's praying or taking an oath of some sort and as she does that these this divine light begins to pulse from her first weekly you know very dim but with each pulse it gets stronger and brighter and by the third pulse these golden angel wings sprout from her back and they flap before shrouding her in a embrace. The divine light keeps getting stronger and stronger until it's a constant glow before it starts to dim down a little bit. The wings spread wild once more before folding neatly behind her, and she stands up. <clears throat> uh, she, she, she's taller. She seems taller. Not like taller than Crozy, Mice, or Glee, but taller than Ari was before. Um, her hair is a little bit longer now. Still, still, still black, not blue like Zeriel, thankfully. Um, her skin tone is different now as well, whereas she used to have that pale kind of corpsey look. It's now replaced with more of a healthy tone with a golden hue to it, almost as if she is glowing slightly. Um, and 
she looks more mature now. Slightly older than she was. Uh, whereas before, Ari would probably be considered cute. Now it's more of a elegant beauty to her now. She takes the sword in her hand and examines it once more. And um, she looks around to see if there's like like a some sort of scabbard or something she can sheath the sword in. Can she find that? Yes, there is definitely a scabbard that you can put the sword in as well. It is setting nicely to the side. Awesome. She walks over to it, and even her walk seems more elegant, more reformed, more graceful. She sheaths the sword and positions it so the sword is is placed neatly on her back between her wings, sort of like Witcher style. And um, she turns towards you all finally, and you see her eyes. They are now the silver orbs a piercing gaze looking back at you all. I think she's always been a piercing gay. Yes, <laughs> piercing gay. Say, <laughs> get fucked, Crozy. Now she's prettier. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Crozy's trying. She just doesn't know how. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think we're done here. We can go save all trail and be heroes. Ari? Yes. Hi. Are you still you? Her brow frowns a little bit. I mean, yes, I'm still Ari. Are you still crazy? I didn't just grow wings. No. Oh, yeah. Can I touch them? She walks over to uh, Core, bends down. Of course. She will gently touch Wing. I like your hair. It's very lovely. I like your eyes. They look like stars. Yep, that's Ari, all right. You look different. She, it's almost like she like turns her head almost like sharply. Yeah, I hope that's okay. I, I don't. I hope that's fine that I look a little different. As long as you are still you, it's fine. I'm still me. Move. <laughs> Did you move? You haven't taken a long rest yet. You can. I know. <laughs> Quick, escape. Rosie's about like, to I want to get, I then... want to get out of here as soon as possible before I do something gay. <laughs> that might be ah, the flu. Just, it just meaner. Got it. Meaner, gay, or blue? <laughs> meaner, <laughs> gay, or blue? That's hard. That's hard to be gayer With than the... blue. Done. Oh, I think I said it before. If they met, Karosi would fucking hate yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. What would you like to do? I suppose we might want to rest first before leaving.
I think that's a good idea. I'll take first watch so y'all can get some rest. You feel okay and everything? I feel better than ever. It's uh -huh. the first time I've felt whole in a very long time. It's a nice she feeling. Looks, she looks a little concerned. It's like, is this a permanent change? Because you'll have to properly give Ariel the sword. And when that time comes, are we are are you asking me this or are you just thinking this? No, she's saying this to her. Uh, yeah. And when that time comes, I will gladly get the sword to her. I don't know what will happen past then. But the sword chose me to make sure it gets back to the rightful owner. And that's what I will do. All right. Honk from a cat. cat. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think that would come through, but yeah, cat just walked into my room. <laughs> it sounded like she just honked like a goose. Kind of, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like <Aww>. that. <laughs> just like that. Just a little honking cat. <laughs> Buddy. I am so excited. One of the fun parts about apartment and car and otherwise looking at your cats is... back. Yeah, soon. 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 My cats. Fuck you. Yeah. Um, yeah, that that that's my interposition about job. Yeah. Who cares about job? Cats. Cats. The reason you're getting a job, cats. Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Right. You all may take. A long rest. <laughs> Even <Cat>. me too. <laughs> Is there anything anyone would like to do or talk about during your long rest? You gotta be quietly jealous of our new angel friend. <clears throat> damn, I'm I wish sitting I was in the corner like, like damn, I, actually I could probably use a sword. <laughs> 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 actually, wait. Match well, my keep... shield. <laughs> she didn't. She didn't take it for other reasons. But yeah. Well, keep in watch. Ari will, will go through the the one book she found back at the prison and read some more. Ew. It like it is easier to read now. Hey, oh it, my god! Roll twenty changed again, and is the best change by far. I've never heard you like a change. Huh? What? Huh? Yeah, what? Fuck? What happened? The the, the map stuff is easier. Oh. oh yeah, they. I I like the change later to the map stuff. Um, and you, you don't. Can... It, it's not this stupid ass one single bar at the top. And you can uh, oh for have DMs. Okay. Party groups, and you can move people by a group instead oh, that's of everyone. Because cool. it was kind of fucked up before. Finally, well, I was just clunky, put one of you on a map. You could I'm always do that. It's it just not hard. easy. Yeah. Yeah. Did I ever send you guys the art of Corozzi I made? No. No, you didn't. Maybe not. Uh, okay. I guess you don't get to see it. Oh, okay. Anyways. <laughs> Give me the art. No. Yeah. Um... Oh, okay. Uh, Ari, as you look through this, you feel kind of like there are people in this world who should not be allowed the power they have, as they just fuck with the most random shit. Is this in the way like Ari's making like a hit list in her mind? Do you want to be making a hit list for various people? Are, are these evil people that need to be brought to justice? <laughs> Some of the people who have uh, removed things from history definitely would classify as evil. Okay. Okay. <laughs> 
have a crusade feeling going on. It's crusading time. Genocide sword. Genocide sword. Genocide sword. Kinda. <laughs> it always comes back. Oops, genocide. it's always just genocide sword. Always murder sword. All right. If there's nothing else that wishes to be done during this break, it is uneventful. You are in a beautiful little cathedral, and you take a beautiful little nap. Uh, I don't with sleep. your beautiful little selves. Okay. You get to stare in awe at Ari for eight hours straight. Are you happy now? Aren't we also in a beautiful little scab? You can't see the beautiful little scab from the inside. Okay. He's drawing a new spell in his uh, in his book. Yeah. Hey Ari. Yes, Glee. How do you feel? <sighs> I feel amazing. You I feel can, amazing as better. in different, or feel amazing as in better? Well, I feel like each and every day we rise a little bit different than we were before. But um, it's hard to explain. It feels... I mean, of course I I, I changed. But um, it feels for the better. And I'm okay with this. Cool. You got a rock. I mean, of course I have rocks. You got a big red one? A ruby? Let me scroll down. Let uh, me check my inventory. She goes through her little satchel she has on her side, pulls out um, a red rock that would be, you know, about the 450 gold worth of a ruby. Will this work? No, it needs to be bigger. Mm -hmm. No, I have, I have another red rock about the same size, but I don't think that's going to help you. All right, well, wait, you have two of them? Yeah. She she walks over. Mm -hmm. I, I guess you're at a table or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she she uh, she she sits down next to you, puts down the two rocks. I got these two red rocks. Goes back to her pouch, pulls out four uh, emeralds. I have these four green rocks. Um, pulls mm. out like like three normal rocks. I have these really cool rocks that mean more to me than these silly cool these green and red rocks. But these are cool because I found them on the ground. And they were dirty at first. But you I need polished... those red rocks? No, no, you can have them if you if you need them. And if you want them, go for it. If you want the green ones, too. If you want these... No, nah, I just need the red ones. Yeah. Sure. He's, like, leaning back, thinking, kind of has a has his pen in his mouth. Well, I guess the, the feather pen and, like, on the bridge of his, the bridge of his uh, nose, just kind of thinking. So, here's the problem that I'm thinking we ha we've been having, right? Mm -hmm. I feel like we're having we're gonna run into a situation where we're gonna have to trap people, you know, hold them hold them up a bit. Okay. But uh, issue. No, no way to do that. So I've been making a little, little, uh, little cage thing, keep people quiet in. That's pretty impressive. Yeah. Well, if you need help with anything, just let me know. Eh. It sounds like you have it pretty much covered. Kinda. 
Still working on the details. I'll let you know if you can help out anymore. Yeah, and if you need more of those red rocks, I can keep my eyes out. Yeah, I need, like, another one and a bit more. Okay, well, you know, we have... We have to go back to the uh, the uh, traveling bazaar eventually. We have a few things being made there. Um, yeah, maybe, maybe there's one there that we can grab. And we got, I got this 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 fire spell book we can sell. Um, we have options to make sure yeah. we get what you need. Yeah, he picks up the rock picks up one of the rocks and then takes it to like a corner cast press the digitation in the corner to clean up the area puts it like sets the rock into the corner cast shillelagh on his on his on his rod and then just starts slamming it it starts hitting it and then when it makes a noise i assume it makes a noise He's like, "Ooh, that's loud." Okay, I'm gonna wait for that till later. Is everything okay? Yeah, yeah it's gotta be beating dust. the shit out of a rock in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's gotta be dust. Oh, I see. Yeah. Well, we'll work on it later. Good luck with that. Oh, quick question. Quick answer. Now, I know you don't sleep anymore, but nope. you've had wings for a lot longer than I have. Yep. How do you how how do you sleep? Or how did you sleep? Were you like a side sleeper? Do you sleep on your back still or did you sleep on your stomach? Stomach most of the time. Other times I, st I slept standing or leaning against something. Well, those last two don't sound comfortable at all. Ah, you get used to it. Huh. Okay. I'll try that tonight and see how that goes. What? Standing? I wouldn't recommend it. Usually usually that's a that's a form of punishment. Form of what now? Punishment? For what? Being a heathen. Well, as an, I guess, an angel now, I can tell you for sure you're not a heathen. Yeah. And if anyone tells you otherwise, then go speak to me about it. Yeah. Probably. But you know what? I can sleep while standing now. Well, I guess everything happens for a reason, and... Unfortunately, I mean, you that's if, I it. that's if I slept. I don't sleep anymore. Anyways, go get your go get your rest. I got I got watch. Okay, well, don't hesitate to wake me up if you need anything. Yep. Good night, Glee. Good night. And Ari powers down. <laughs> <laughs> Does she still do that? Where she just kind of just, like, stops functioning. I, I imagine you see her, like, kind of, like, you know, she, like, lays on her side. No, mm -hmm. she turns her stomach. No, she, like, stands up. Mm -hmm. like, no, and then she just kind of, like, kind of, like, leans against something and just, like, stays there with her eyes open. No, this sucks. And she just, like, lays on her side again. <laughs> But I guess you would see, if like, it, her eyes are, like, it, still kind of open. If it helps, if it helps, laying on your side do, is probably the best way to do it. Okay, I'll try that. If it if it changes anything, you might want to try folding the wings over uh, your shoulders. And then mm -hmm. downwards. What? That's a great idea. Uh, she'll take her cloak and, like, get balled up into, like, a little, like, pillow, and then she'll, like, have her wings, like, kind of, like, fold over her a little bit. Mm -hmm. Like this? Yeah. Oh. See, see, like, for you, I imagine there's a, I imagine there's less, there's more bones along the top, 
as he like as he like touches the 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 feathers at the your wings at the top yeah more more bones at the top not much not much on underneath here well, this me on the other more. unfortunately i have to do this and he like folds his wings and it turns into like a miniature cloak at least you look pretty cool doing that eh. but then like the cloak of my cloak so it sucks and i can't wear cloaks and it's like oh come on cloak yeah cloaks are pretty cool too right Well, thanks for the the great idea here. Yeah. Get some sleep. Yeah. Good luck with your uh, rock crushing. I uh, uh, probably gonna wait till morning, honestly. And she is shut down already. She doesn't answer. She's like, do you? All right. Ooh, Ari better window down shut down music. Uh, Mice would like to, since this is probably the closest place to the gods in hell. Smile. Um, she'll uh, go and thank the god whore for his aid. Did you say whore? Yes. He continues to worship the god whore. This is the <laughs> god that she follows. Always have. Stop worshipping whores! Not worshipping whores. Worship Slay whore. queen. Uh, honestly, Thanks, look, bye. if you're worshipping whores and you still make it to level 11, 12 paladin, keep doing what you're doing. It's working out. Chance, buckaroo. Oath of the simp, alright? That's what I'm hearing right now. Oath of the simp? Alright, that champ. Alright, is there anything in particular you want to do with this prayer? Or anything you'd like to gain out of it? I mean, it's mostly a prayer of thanks, like... Mm -hmm. Give me the strength to carry my carry my war against my enemies, and I won't stop until I'm done here. Nothing really to gain from it, I suppose. Okay. You feel emboldened afterwards. Yeah, I definitely needed that for sure, 100%. Because I've never been punished for that before. Hell yeah. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Cool. In the morning, Lulu looks even bigger than she did before. She is starting to look about the size of the elephant that she was. Um, George Lulu. It is probably a little bit disconcerting, in all honesty. Um, Ma, the elephant's getting bigger. Ma! And, but she looks happily to all of you and says, you know, I, I, I think, I think I can make it so we don't have to go back out through the scab. I can do that too. Oh, I don't know. How far up is, is the sky? From where you're at, pretty far. Is it more than 500 feet up far? You're at the bottom of the scab. So yeah. Yeah, I don't know what that means, unfortunately. I, I'm going to go with it's more than 500 feet, unfortunately. Alright. Fair enough. Describe a complex three-dimensional shape with just words. 
the scab. It's scabulous. That's a bad word. I don't like that. You didn't say use good words. He got you there. <laughs> anyway, Lulu offers to clear the scab for you. Would you like to take her up on that? I think that's sure. Good. Please, I, mean, I don't have shoes and the ground feels weird. As long as it doesn't put too much strain on you, that'd be wonderful. And Cor, I can carry you if you don't want to walk on this scabby ground. I... Just hop at things. Just <laughs> hop at things. It's not too much trouble. I can. I think I can just. And she lets out this loud trumpet. Oh. It is deafening. And then the temple you're in begins to glow as an explosion of radiant light tears through the scab surrounding it. When the light begins to fade, Ari, you can see a bit faster than everyone else can and it looks like you can actually see the outside again through the stained glass. Unfortunately, you're still in hell. <laughs> Yay, hell! Yay, heck. Woo. Party and a burnus. Well, that definitely does the trick. We should be able to get out just by, what, flying up now? Or just walk out? Probably just walk out the front door. It's a lot easier than traversing caverns of scab. Mm -hmm. I just start walking out. <laughs> Yeah, Karuzi, as you walk out, it looks like the ground around you has been cleansed. It is uh, clear of all of the creatures that were previously here. Except for one. For, if you'll remember, the creatures here were actually digging for something. Mm -hmm. that had been held down by the scab and is no longer under the scab because the scab is no longer there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Oopsie daisies. You know, be fine. we always do that removing scabs weren't a good idea for whatever it was trying to heal. Yeah, doctors say, doctors say don't do that. Mm-hmm. Lee, why didn't you tell us any better? <laughs> uh, I'm not why a doctor. Why did you let us be stupid? This is your fault. <laughs> You're the healer. <laughs> why, why is it always my fault? <laughs> <laughs> it's all my fault. As you all, or at least Karozi, because I guess she's the only one who said she left, come face to face with Crocotech. Oh, yay. Who? Uh, Okay, Kind of hate that. The uh, good old pet of your good old friend, the guy you tried to kill last week. Which one? <laughs> Who? 
the god. This is god. the pet of the 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 big fucker. Oh yeah, you, you know who. You know oh. who's pet. Draco you know who. God damn. Should I, you should know I, who? I, am I, am I where I am? I feel like this is a bad idea to be where I am. You, Kurosi's like here. The rest of y'all are in the building. Let's give the, a building. Here's yeah. a building. I love the, the <laughs> cathedral. So. Here's a door to the building. Kurosi's like peeking outside. Oops, giant monster. I think I'd just open up the door and look back in and be like, yeah, there's something we gotta fight. <laughs> yeah, that thing's outside. I don't like that in its fucking picture. It's puking little things. Just a bunch of little guys. Yeah. <clears throat> hey, aren't you a little guy? Aren't you a little guy? Where's the lie? <laughs> I'm guessing does love puking. we're rolling initiative. If you would like to leave the um, temple. Nah, we live here now. Okay. Campaign over. We die here. Of course you want to leave. Um, you don't have to. I mean, you might die. You'd probably run out of food. Mm -hmm. Water, most likely. I'll be fine. Or he's just alone, surrounded by your dead friends, like, huh. Grip mice. Mice said, nah, not today. It happens all the time. <laughs> oh. Mice went, huh, there's an attack? What, uh, huh, huh? Huh happening? Who? I... I appreciate that even though Amon had so much of a worse initiative, you somehow roll worse than she did. Every <laughs> time, yeah. Like, it's pretty Because her initiatives were awful. I remember sometimes she'd get a zero. <laughs> Just, you, you still, you still usually beat her for most times. Yeah. yeah. All right, Karuzi, you peek your head out. You see this big guy. He seems to be eating, like, pieces of the scab that have left been left behind by this Aww, cleansing light. Ah, gross. As you open the door, he turns towards you, though you're not what is interested in him. Um, real quick, how much temp HP did we get? Oh, from the long rest. I'm from... assuming 11. From Glee, right? Yeah, from Glee. Uh, is it 11 Glee or 12 11. now? Well, let's say... One yeah. I'll, I'll, tell you, I'll tell you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi. <clears throat> no, no. Hi. Yes? Yes, yes. The build up. 11.5. Oh, it's 11. It's 11. Point five. I, gotta put a, I gotta put the floor button in. That half point, though. The... Could save a life. Fun. Could it's save a life. Thing it's a half hit point, guys. Come on. Nope, there is now. Uh, oh. All right. Uh, well, I'm gonna shoot it with my gun. No, you're not allowed to shoot it with a gun. Okay. Yeah, you shoot it with a gun. Do all of them hit? Yep. Yeah. Bang, bang, bang. Then I go back inside. <laughs> and that's my turn. You go back inside. Ari. This thing is a disgusting scourge on the world and does not belong here. Her wings unravel. I'll hold back the beast. You you all stay safe, and she will dart out with her fly speed of 90. And as she does, I like to use the bonus action to ex to uh 
You know what? Hexblade. I will Hexblade it as well. All and right. I go up there. And I will reach for the Sword of Zeriel. It's a 19 hit. Yep. Plus five more with the uh, Hexblade curse. Okay. Add a, add a thing, add a modifier thing, so whenever it happens. You know, I should totally do that. Yeah, just like the Radiant one that we... Necrotic one that we did. You can do the exact same for Hexblade. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I'm, I, I am intelligent. <laughs> I didn't even think of that when we were fucking with your sheet. Uh, it's five, and it's just slashing, right? It's not like. I think so. It should be just a slashing. That's the base. Yeah, and it's uh, it's equal to my proficiency, right? Uh, I believe so. Should just be another five damage. Yes. All right. Either your proficiency or your modifier, but either way, it's five right now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Uh, it, he barely makes that Constitution save. And I slash into it again. Sixteen. Sixteen also hits. Oh god. He's a big fleshy boy. Oh, well, setting his HP to 36, not what I was trying to do there. Just dies. <laughs> yeah. Uh, all right, I'll make another con save. Cool. All right, he turns to look at you. You are intriguing to him. <laughs> Unfortunately for him, he doesn't want to bite you. Because if he just bites you, he might die. So instead he's going to vomit. Okay. Can he not? Gross. <laughs> Just once. <laughs> As he is going to vomit up some bulgurus. Ooh, lots of monkeys. A lot of vomiting monkeys. Uh, guys! I'm gonna wanna see this! <laughs> not my monkeys, not my circus. <laughs> no! <laughs> monkey. Monkey. Oh, those monkeys. Monkey. Monkey, monkey. strong together. <laughs> monkey. And he vomits up four monkeys. You know, you really shouldn't eat monkeys. Monkey. Back Can't the system. barrel of them. <laughs> Or, uh, you got skipped. There you go. Ar Ari looks cool as fuck, and then suddenly you see the worst thing imaginable. Big guy. Which is this thing monkeys. vomiting um, monkeys. All right. I'm going to do some hasties. I'm going to do one on. Mice. Mm. Um, level three spell, and then I'm also gonna do it on. Let's do it on Corozy just in case her gun jams again like last time. So you'll have another yep. hit if you want to, or fix your gun. Feels bad, man. Oh God, Thank is it this so one? Much. Uh huh. Ye. Yeah. Case this part of. I think it is. I do one last. Um, three, which will be two. Okay. 
Um, and then I'm gonna also give the temp HP to mice. Here you go. Yeah, I got two extra. Two extra than what you had. What? Let's do pink this time. I'm gonna move a bit closer to the door so I can see out of it. Alright. <coughs> that is my turn. Alright. Glee. It is unfortunate. How there's a guy big there. is this spell? Man, the monkeys are really nicely lined up for something like a cone of cold or a <laughs> lightning bolt. 40 foot, 10 foot radius. 10 foot radius. 10 foot radius. Yeah, I can hit the people, th three of them that matter. Or I could do a wall of light. He's probably going to keep vomiting people too, so... Might be wall time. Yeah, I guess. <gasps> wall of light! Uh... Line. Nope. Line. No, maybe maybe as a beam. Yeah, beam is better. Uh, how long? How big is it? I'm pretty sure it's five feet. Yeah, it's five feet. Wee. Yeah, fuck it. That that's that's better. Can I hit all of you? Kind of, yeah! Nice. Wall of light! Oh. Is it now or on their turn? They have to make it. Uh, right now, because they because I start, it's at the end of their turn or when the when the spell is cast. I'm pretty sure. Okay. Hold on, let's see. Da -da 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 when the wall appears, yeah. When the wall appears, make Constitution saving throw, and a creature that ends its turn in the wall. Yeah, so two of them save, and he saves. Half damage for yep. the others? Yep, so eight for everybody that saved, and 16 for everybody else. Oh, oh wait, I'm sorry. The... I'm sorry. It's it's 10, because I, I have this thing. Um, this thing. Uh, which target would you like it on? One of the ones that failed? Uh, yeah. So, 20 damage to the one that failed, and then... Don't, don't move, monkey. Stay on your line. Where were you before, goddamn? Oh, well. There's, there's fine. <clears throat> All right, and two of them are blinded. Uh, yeah. No see. No see. All right. Oh, you're feeling fast as fuck, boy. Go, my go. Go, my go. Speed. 
giant speed. I move there. And then I will make my three attacks of, of, of pokiness. Alright, um, the one right in front of you is blind. Great! Puck. Puck. Why is the Puck. A not on there? All of those hit. And then, butt time. Wait, it's dead! Okay, well, it would have missed probably anyway. And it would have... Great. You, you style on it a little bit, but also it's dead. Fantastic. Karozi, you went back inside for Ari to run out into danger! Yeah, I saw that. You also have haste, don't forget. Yep. So I'm gonna zoom out. <laughs> and <laughs> so <it> break sounds. <laughs> uh I'm gonna be like, God damn it, the monkeys are back and I'm gonna start shooting. Ah oh, shit, it's monkeys at the end. Who are you shooting? Uh, I'm actually this gonna keep campaign shooting. has a lot of monkeys, actually. I'm gonna keep shooting the big guy because I don't want more monkeys. So, Don't you like monkeys? One, two, three. I'll hit. Alrighty. And because we found out I can do this, my last action is to reload! Haha! Kablam. Alright. And I'm gonna stay out. Yeah. Well, no, there's no reason to. I'm going to go back in. If they start looking real bad, I will. But, like, there's no reason to needlessly make my health go down while they're doing okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> Says the highest HP person. <laughs> Not really wrong. That is... All right, monkey time. Monkey blind, monkey stumble out. This way, swing with disadvantage. Paunch, paunch, paunch. Who is it attacking? I'm sorry, that was supposed to be at Ari with disadvantage. Well, if it attacks a friend, and I, I hold on, I have to. Read the sentinel exact again, because it's a little silly. You you have to be within five feet of the ally. Yeah, but, okay. A creature within five feet against a target other than you. So an, en an enemy. Oh, oh, enemy. Okay, yeah, then you're good. Ow, it doesn't like the fact that it's getting hit. Uh, I think uh, the only one that has a chance of hitting Ari is the... 18? 18, yeah. Yeah. I have 18 AC. I think it hits, right? Yep. Yep. He punches you in the face! Dang. After swinging wildly twice. It ate through all the temp HP in one hit. That is the trouble with monkeys. They do punch a lot. This one's going to move in here towards mice. This one's going to decide to stop it. No, he's not going to do that. He can't fit there. It's going to go this way, I guess. Then he gets stuck. So he's going to... Go invisible. Invisible apes. 
Mice, the one attacking you, is going to do so recklessly. The 25 hits. Because it's a fucking 25. For nine. as he swings into you and kind of just hits you a little bit. Just a bit. I'll continue to hit the big boy. All right. 14. I'm just going slower and lower and lower. 14 is a miss, unfortunately. That's fine. Are still getting used to the weight of this sword? She definitely hits. For Jesus Christ, 41 damage. <laughs> I can't remember what the con save is for, but he's making it. <laughs> oh, did I not put it there? Yeah, you have to click on the description. You did. You had it working when we, but it's for being blinded. Oh, it's because I have it working for the the one handed version of it. Oh, but not the two handed. Okay. Yeah. Uh, there you go. It's it should be working for the two handed attack as well. Now, I knew I was forgetting something. And also, Alex, if you want to check that I did that those 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 attacks right really quick that'd be fantastic as well what do you mean just to check to see if, if i have like the right like 1d 10 plus 6 plus craziness all that it looked stuff. like it looked like it was right yeah it all swords, right. the sword's busted all right anything else you would like to do by the way, you could see the invisible creature. I sure can. Um, as a bonus action, I would like to extend the glow on the sword out to its full. Oh, hold up. Let's see here. To. 10 feet so it's it's 10 feet of bright light and then another 10 of dim light of holy light which should make them have disadvantage while they're in the light that is correct fiends that find this fiends find the sword's light disconcerting and painful and even if they can't see it and have disadvantage on attack rolls made within the sword the weapon's radius of bright light. Assuming they are fiends. Yes. So 10, 10 fit circle for the bright light? Yeah. Hopefully that's not blinding to me and mice, but we'll see. It's Last not. I checked, you're not fiends, so. Look at all these auras! Gleek is to it. Ah! <laughs> Sorry, Glee. <laughs> Reco Tech, do, do you get to vomit again, my boy? You do. Uh oh. Will he vomit? He will vomit. He will vomit some more. Ah, let's let's do Knowles this time. Let's work our way down the list, shall we? Oh no. Ten gnolls! Please no. <laughs> Who wants to vomit this way now? One of these. Ten of these. Honestly, ten's not that bad for 3D. Six. A lot more gnolls. So, uh, yeah. A little above average. Could have been a lot worse, yeah. Could have been better, could have been worse. 
This is more fun this way. The gnolls really like are not wanting to come and play. There we go. I'm just double them. I see 12 gnolls, just so you, just you're aware, and then one white one. Make sure you're going straight, <laughs> whoever's measuring. There you go. You gotta make sure you do it straight. I'm never straight. I, I know. Oh. That's because there's two gnolls who shouldn't be there. Okay. Oh, okay. Aww. <laughs> one does not spawn directly on top of Ari. Be a terrible decision. All right. It really would. He'd just die. Kor, uh, this that... creature, it, it still disgorges. Yeah. So would that hit the creature, the big one, if I put it there? Technically? I'll allow it. Thanks. I'd say so. He, does, he doesn't move, right? <clears throat> he, he theoretically can, but he does not. He doesn't. Okay. Okay, if he doesn't move, then... Oh yeah, he oh, in no, the wall. Made a dumb True. Decision. So ten damage. damage. Yeah. All right. And everything in that little little thingy right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, synaptic static. I don't know how to keep this here. So you know, clicking off. Uh, if you hit, it, if you're looking at the the stuff, the the measuring tool stuff, uh -huh. you can hit linger. Oh, I see. I think it's like right here. Yeah, yeah. it's right there. Okay. Erm. Um. Now there's a trash can icon on Ari. Cause oh, she is can... trash. Sorry. No, she's not trash. Stop <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, intelligence saves. That's not quite the Knoll's forte. Knoll's first. I was like, hmm. Dead. 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 <laughs> He's a mega dead. You're missing one. He, 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 he wasn't alive to begin go. with. Oh, wow. Dead. Natural 20. Still got an 18. They oh, could, man. They couldn't make that roll. You know what? Yeah, you're right. I don't know why I bothered. <laughs> <laughs> I took out a lot of them. Uh, this this guy, he this guy, special. he he could he could make it. Yeah, he's special. He, he doesn't. Could, he could make it. He doesn't. He's not dead though. He's not dead though. Okay. He's not dead though. But he is synaptic static, which means he does have a D six negative to attack rolls. Is there okay. is there something else too? Uh, let me post it. All right. And ability checks. And ability checks. Okay. As well as yeah, it's saving throws for spells, but I don't think it. I don't think don't it think spells it very well. No. So Cracker Tech also cannot pass the DC. All right. So he will take some some brain damage. His brain bad. All right. I will get out of that now. Um. Oh, does it not linger? No, that was just to show him who he had to roll oh, okay. for. It makes an intelligence saving throw at the end of his turn. Yep. Each of their turns, yeah. Until it saves. Mm -hmm. All um, right. Uh, yeah. He made his brain so fuzzy. Mm -hmm. Sure did. I also took out a lot of them. That was my turn. Good job, brain, Core. Brain fuzzy approach target. Disadvantage and brain fuzzy. Bite. Claw, claw. Alright. The 18 will miss no matter what. The 20 will also miss. As he stumbles around. And wildly bites at Ari. Brain hurty. Brain hurt too bad. Stop it. Lee. 
There's some monkeys. There's some doggos. The hey, are, are you resistant to fire damage? At all? Mm, I do not think that's part of my resistances. Okay, no. no I just it, it just changes how I aim. I mean, it would be fair if you shot with fire, so it's like, you know, I hit you with Cone of Cold, it's he only would fair. Never do that. He would never <laughs> do that unless he knew that, you know, you were resistant to fire in any way. But so it's, were that's why, he, that's why he assumed you did the cold damage, too, because he, he was like, he, he, he can take it. He's, like, super good with cold. That, that wasn't the reason why she did it, is it? Sure, yeah. Uh, let's see. I'm pretty sure I could make it so that... Yeah, yeah, I could, I could, I could, I could angle this, right? Uh, circle. Oh no, my other one went away. I'll I'll fix it after I put this one out. Uh Yeah, I wish in addition to a lingering they had a permanent essentially where you have to trash can it to get it to go away instead of just yeah. click again. But Okay. Yeah. Flame strike. Oh no. Oh my god. So, Glee flips through his pages really quick, thinks about it, flips to a different page. Ari! Ari, move your foot! Oh, yeah, thank you. Moves it slightly and, over. And he slams the, uh, the that the rod down into the ground and in a very like kind of mirror mirroring the same like the the action a huge sword just a huge flaming sword just comes slamming down right between the the knoll and the the whatever the, the vomit boy all right and it Noel's explodes. Had a bad day. But not too bad. Oh, wait. No, it's a save, so he Yeah, no, he's he's minus. fine. He takes Good half. For him. What? Krakotek is not dexterous? Yay! And then Glee moves out of the way. As the, uh, as uh, he's like got the rod in his hand, he's like, <laughs> damn it, Omni! You're supposed to make it not that hot. He likes it to be very hot, though. Uh, and I will put my wall back. Okay. Knowles, they want in. One can, can swing through the door to Rosie. Rude. Ah. Yeah, that, meant, that hits. <laughs> You've been poked! Oh no, my temp HP! Nice! The gnolls are going for the people inside the building, but there's still monkeys here. 
Uh, I'm going to ignore the monkeys because. Yeah, yeah. Um, because they're um blinded by the light, and what have you. This so one they is can, not. Yeah, they can make a text opportunity if they want, I guess. So does that monkey also have disadvantage? I'm trying to figure out what I put that. Why that thing is on the monkey. I don't um, know, but he does have disadvantage for. No, he doesn't, because he's not in the light. Cause is it? Because it's ten for bright light, and then another ten for dim light. Mm-hmm. I think it's only the bright light that affects. Oh, okay. Him that way. Cool, cool, cool. Still learning. Launch. <laughs> Nope, Not that one mattered. Yeah, that does hit me. Oh, you no. punched. I've, I've, I've been wounded. No, uh, let me then, heal uh, you. I will start with the knoll that is nearest to the door. He looks bad now. Okay, I will butt strike him. I bet he's dead now. He's dead. Alright, and then I'll attack the one above him. Okay. Another 29. And I'll probably have to hit again. He looks bad now. He looks dead now. I clear ads. You do. That's where I exist now. Karozi, on the other side of the wall, there's an old. Okay. And I Don't come to over. the door. I look at mice. Are you good? Mm-hmm. Yep. <clears throat> Alright. Uh, then I'm going to shoot the ugly thing. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. I technically get one more. He is not loving you. Yeah, well, uh, I don't care. Not love, man. And I'm going to step out of the doorway so the other two range people can also, you know, use it to shoot. You would technically uh, move out of the range of the knoll. That's Going fine. around the door. Okay. The, the, knoll, the knoll wants to stab you. He doesn't. But he wants to. Does mice? No, mice doesn't get to attack. Never mind. I think Mice does because he attempts to attack. Oh his... yeah, I do. Yeah. So how really. how dare he? Okay. Okay. He he regrets. He's been cowed. <laughs> Poor no. They they they've been in this thing's stomach for days, <laughs> if not years. Look, choose a better ride next time. Okay, <laughs> like. It's not their fault. They didn't choose this life. They didn't choose to get eaten. I didn't It's ask. monkey time. Aggressively disadvantaged monkey. He's going to punch at Ari. Nine, ten, eight. <clears throat> Does not hit Ari. Not so blind monkey. gonna go in a second but first oh no invisible monkey he's moved he's in the room now gonna punch Kurozi twice and then uh it's the giant monkey in the room with us right now Uh, 21 because Uh, he has advantage on the first one and then 18 Okay, um, 
both hit. Which ones? No, Which fr ones first two are on eight? Corozzi. So the yeah. 21 and the 18. And then the 16 okay. is on Core, which I think still hits. No, that misses. Major. Oh, well, mine hit. Major. Tanky motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> it's the first time you ever used it. <laughs> what do you mean? I've always had Major armor on. Yeah. She's used it. It's just not often come up. Because yeah, get I, I always take a first level spell every single morning off, and I just don't say I have it on. It's just something yeah, that's no, assumed. That's, that that is how I usually run with e. mages. Is I assume you use you cast it because you would know too. All right. Uh, so the the monkey punches Corozzi and then swings at Core, but a <sighs> shimmering nice. field of light protects her. The monkey is in the room with you this moment. Don't like. The last monkey. Oh, I'm on the GM layer still. So. Will come towards mice who can't do shit about it because she's already used her reaction. It doesn't hit though. Yeah, that's a negative. All right. Your friends are being swarmed by monkeys. I'm also swarmed. Um, would she disengage to help her friends, though? Not with this big guy here. Get the big guy. Get the big guy. If he wasn't here, she would turn around and help her friends. Fifteen. Yep. Thirty-nine. All right, swing again. Twelve. Nope. Nope. Say edge. He pulls his head back as if to vomit again as you swing. Anything else? No, I think I'm out of things to do with my bonus action for now. Fair enough. Let's see, does he actually vomit again, or was it a faint? Oh, oh my god. You want to relax with those sixes? Um, working our way downtown, uh, we're, oh, we're going to have a target-rich environment as we're having 66 wretches. Please, no. What yeah. the fuck? Oops, all hey. dretches. Oops, all dretches. Where will these guys go? So many motherfucking heads. You wonder, why does this thing eat so many of its allies? Tasty. Army of Dretches. They are ready. He's done now. Core takes on more the... radiant damage. Oh yeah, he does because he just thinks for himself. Yep. Uh... Core, you see through the wall of light that he has once again vomited, and now there's just a bunch of those little things everywhere. Alright. Wow, uh, that's a big monkey in front of me. Oh so yeah, much. there's also a monkey in your face. Um... <laughs> hmm. I have no touch spells. 
you have a uh, chicken spell. That would drop Can't my concentration on my other one, though. I know, I'm I'm just teasing. <laughs> um, oh, you could turn him into a literal monkey! <laughs> would this hit? Yeah, it sure would. Rosie, if I turned it that way. Um, how how big is this? Hold on. Wait, do I have to roll on charges? Hold on. Pause. Where's my heart? No, I don't have to roll on it. Okay. Um. Uh, uh. How big is this? Sixty feet. Oh. Oops. Um. Hmm. Probably not. Um, okay. Perka perka purr. I don't have much. This kind of shit. You've done a lot already. Aha, uh -huh, I found the combat type that doesn't work for core. <laughs> the solver of all Things my combat types. Right in my face. <laughs> it didn't work so well for the gnolls. Most of them died spell. immediately. All of my shit's ranged spell attack, which means they are disadvantaged with it in my face. Uh, you can... You could, um... Sacred Flame. Using your double thing, doodle. That's true. It will even allow you to Sacred Flame through the wall to the knoll over there, having him be within five feet. Heck because yeah. Because I'm a kind person. Eh, I'll do that then. I love when uh, the DM is kind and allows me to follow the rules. I was almost max damage if that wasn't a one. Oh, they take the damage. This knoll's dead. Monkey not dead, though. Monkey not dead. Monkey pretty far from dead, admittedly. Oh god, okay. <laughs> That's all I can do. Yeah, this monkey hadn't been hit before he came in here, I don't think. Other than the wall. <laughs> Alright, this knoll, he is... He is struggling with life his brain hurts real bad um but he has a mission his mission is to try to hit ari he doesn't do it so his brain hurts too bad oh he also has this advantage so he super doesn't do it no wait what is he i don't think he's he is not a fiend so he would not have disadvantage but he still doesn't do it. Yeah, Knowles aren't, but... I think everything else is some assist. Glee. And they just keep coming, and they just keep coming, and they just keep coming, and they just keep coming. Alright. Well... I cast. Hold on, I will move first. So I can see people. Alright. And then I will cast. Scatter! Scatter. Alright. I think everyone but Ari gets to. Uh... Hold on. Oh. 
she can move? I can move. And... See within 120 feet. Okay. And... Arozi can move. But I'm gonna try to make the, make the two monkeys roll wisdom saves. No! <laughs> not trying to be wise, monkeys! Okay. Oh. All right, so they go way, way over, uh, over there. Uh, the branches are other you side. know what? Let's let's ping where I want to put them. Mm -hmm. Uh, I want to put them on this side of the. Let's put them as far as they can go. Hold on, I got to measure. Goodbye, wall. Well, let's just let's just remember that the wall is always there. As far as they'll go that the way. <laughs> All right. So you other two. Yeah, you guys can move. Um. Go right here. Now, I was knocking scatter before, but damn. I think it's. I think I'm good where I am now that the monkeys are gone. Thank you. All right, and Karozi, you can move if you want. Monkey removal spell. Monkey removal. <clears throat> uh, I mean, I'm pretty. I'm fine. I'll just go okay. out my next turn. Okay. Then in that case, can I move the other? Oh, I know that's the only other creature I can I can reach is the null. But I mean, it's a null. It's a null. Just a baby. All right. Uh, I think all. Oh, there's one surviving regular null. <laughs> he, he's gonna spear mice. He's gonna do it. He's gonna do it. He's not, not gonna do it. <laughs> he almost did it. He, he tried real hard. He really did. If, if he weren't so damn fast, maybe he could have done it. I, and now he's I, just going to die for his insolence. I murder him. <laughs> this much. He, he, he regrets dead? his actions. He's dead now. He, he regrets his life as he is now dead good back to the monkey and knoll we're moving I'll grab the knoll okay uh, I'm not gonna blow it up as funny as it would be no you just kill it blow you it. just kill it just casual kill it yeah and then I will use my last attack on the monkey for that many all right, the monkey is blind. The monkey is very hurt. The monkey. Wait, crippish for that monkey. Oh yeah, yeah. That, the monkey is blind. The monkey is very hurt. Yeah. Okay, that'll be me. Rosie, this thing. How many more things could it possibly have in its stomach? I'm so uh, glad well, it made I want to add here. bullets to that list as I'm going to shoot it. Okay. One, two, I gotta reload. Three. All right, he is also looking bloodied. Um. If I action search, do I get four again? No, I just sorry. No. We'll do that. 
Okay. You say I'm tired of your existence. Thirty-five plus Christ. <laughs> I'm good. I'll go back in. All right, these monkeys—they return to the battle. They're back on the map now. I forgot Blind about blood. those monkeys. The blind one. Oh, he—he's trying so hard because he doesn't really know how to run away. He can't see. Uh, uh, none of those will hit Ari, which is the only person he knows where they're at. So, he's just having a sad day. Oh, I get to attack him. Oh. True. <laughs> Poor monkey. Oh! Oh, no. no. <laughs> I'll refrain from blowing up this one too, but it's, it's great pathetic. choice as he is dead. Woo! Yeah, there we go. Yay, crit. Ari, the monkey has been removed from your premises. There are so many dretches. <laughs> Now, would I get disadvantage if I cast Cold of Cone? Co nope, cone because of Cold. You wouldn't be rolling anything. Yeah, Cone of Cold is just a saving throw. Neat. Ari's going to shimmy over here. Oh, no. <laughs> I think this is a good place. It snapped a corner. Yes. Yeah, very foot cone. 60 foot cone, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh my think, well, god. I think that's a good cone. Yeah, I think that's a really good cone. All Mega right. kill. Yeah, 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 yeah. I will I will cast cone of cold through this creature and into the wretches. Where's my cold cone? Cold. I'll never say it right. Not much damage. Minus the 10, so only 29. Oh, oh yeah, only only 29. O only 29. Let's see. Or the Ice Age. Dead. 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 Alive. Oh. Alive. Alive. Dead. 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 I haven't been keeping count. It's Alive. four so far. I'm sure they wish they were dead this Wait, point, Wait, you mean how many you've rolled? Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six... Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You need six more. Dead, 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 dead. And or I... lived. Goodbye, dretches. <laughs> and the oh, big guy. Right. So I have to add him back to the initiative because I deleted the wrong one. But how alive are they? Let's see. 29 divided by 2. Are you skill padding? Listen. Core did it earlier. True. Oh, wow. They are so... Um, I like 1 HP. <laughs> living very long if they decide to stay here. <laughs> I bet he's going to throw up more guys. So. Uh, he might... But first, he has to make a constitution save. Only takes 14. Unless he's resistant. But 7. Alright, the dretches, um, the ones that are still alive will run over the corpses of their fallen friends. The fuck away from here. <laughs> yeah, I'd run too. Uh, if you haven't figured this out yet, dresses are fucking cowards, and they hate their lives. Mm -hmm. Do you vomit more, my dear Crocotech? No. 
Oh my god. He'll just bite Ari. Oh, he has attacks. <laughs> All right, this thing can fight. I think that'll hit regardless. 26. It, it turns into he's a 22. Been he's been supposed to be making intelligence saving throws, At by the, the end way. Of his turns, yeah. He can't make it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, never mind. I'm sorry, but <laughs> he would, but <laughs> like, like he, he would love to. He can't. Um, a twenty-two. Twenty-two. Yep. Yeah. What does shield give? Plus five. Plus five. Mm -hmm. Yep. I will shield this. All right. He does not bite you. As a bright holy light just shimmers off of Ari. You see his teeth like tear into it a little bit, but it doesn't tear into you. And that's all that matters. Just say no. Sure. There <laughs> is no more monkey. Um okay. Wall of light, true. Wall of light true. Can he does he have like a zero movement speed? No, he can move. He can move. He just he doesn't just want isn't. to. He's lazy. <laughs> Look, man, if I was that fat, I also wouldn't move. <laughs> I just, at a certain point, the wall of light has done so much damage. He's um, throwing. He's throwing. He's throwing. I'm going to Chaos Bolt at level four. Big bounce, let's go. 14 probably misses. Fourteen Joe's misses you. Awesome. <laughs> Yo. Yo. That's the first time I've missed with that spell, I think. Um, I think that's all I can do. Alright. Glee, Ari just turned uh, the field of dretches into popsicles. Yeah, and this woo! Didn't She's doing vomit. it! She's doing it! All right, I'm going to use 10 feet of the Wall of Light to shoot a Wall of Light. Okay. Does he make the save still? Yes. He has to make it every single time. Okay. That's why this spell is so fucking good. I'm pretty sure he has to make it. Uh... Oh, no, he doesn't. He doesn't. Okay, so he just takes the damage. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's an attack. You can make an attack from the wall. That's just happening. It would have been cool if it, if it made them... blended. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Alright, nice. Here. At least right now, there are no monkeys. No monkeys on the side of the wall. It's time to blow up big boy. Don't have advantage from this, so... I'm trying, alright? Not blinded from... He refuses. He doesn't want to not see. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Uh, miss, probably? Yep, 14 is a miss. That many, and then another attack. And then he'll strike. You're still hasted. 16 hits. Oh, right. You only have three attacks with haste. I'm yeah. thinking of Kuro's. Not a fighter, yeah. No, it said I get the extra dice. Well, that's me. <laughs> Being at the bottom of the initiative order for this fight kind of sucks. I mean. Y'all are doing great. It's just like you're doing great. You've been. Do you see your D8s? Yeah, the D8s are nice. But... Yeah. You've been rolling real hot on those improved divine smites. Yeah, it is. It's good. Anyway, he's looking bullet riddled. And also slashed a lot. 
All right. Well, I come out and I reload and I'm going to shoot him. Nick. Man, oh I really would have loved some of this last week. <laughs> Jams four times. I know. All right, the Bulgaros, they, they see how badly Krokotek is doing. And they decide, no, that fucker ate us. And leave. Understandable. All right. You could Hi. put down Yanagu's pet. Yeah. Oh, fuck. 44? Yeah. How do you kill this monstrosity? Dang. It's a fiend, technically. Uh, fuck you, right. It's a monstrosity, too. Look at it. Alright, lifts the sword above her head, and the sword begins to glow a lot brighter, and she just slashes into it, and... The sword gets lodged in there, and like through its mouth, you can see the light just glow even brighter and brighter, and just it just kind of dissolves the creature around the sword before like the sword like goes back to its normal glow. So now there's like this massive hole in this creature's face, I guess, or I guess its whole face is gone at this point. It's like a much more elegant version of my, I don't know, blows up smite. <laughs> I don't know, it blows up smite. <laughs> All right, you kill this creature. After a few moments, another couple dretches claw their way out. Oh. But they don't look like they want to fight you. Bail out. <laughs> they look like they just want to run away. Oh no, it's the crew of the vehicle that was this fucking creature. Uh, and they will just run away unless you decide to put them down, which you can also just do. <laughs> if... If my ghost is strike, Ari will, like, put her hand out, try to stop her. No. That is if you... Do you attack? Okay. No, actually she doesn't. Okay. Alright, you let the pathetic worms that were worm meal uh, run away. If there's, only, if there's one kind of fiend that you won't just kill inside, it's a dredge. Hey, you kill them in like the in, in the uh, the uh, dreamscape, so <laughs> it did happen, but that was not real. Okay, true, true. It's not real. Fake dredges are one thing. Real dredges are pathetic. <laughs> and you've survived, Krokotek. Well. That fight would have been like three a rounds. Lot. I feel like if he hadn't thrown up. Yeah. <laughs> She got thrown up. <laughs> Stop puking on everything. As the corpse of this creature disintegrates into black ichor, it looks like this area of Avernus is starting to heal. Ooh. It is still deserty, but you think with time this might become more of an oasis. Compared to literal hell. However, you are still in hell. Where would you like to go? What would you like to do? Driver win. You fought very well. I'm proud of each and every one of you. The, the, you're very good with the sword. It's well, sorry. Really dangerous. <laughs> well, if you're evil or a fiend, sure, but I'm sure none of you have anything to worry about. Uh. 
Yeah, I'm glad you're on our side. Uh... <laughs> I sure wouldn't want to be a fiend. Are y'all afraid of me? <laughs> Sweats and fiend. <laughs> oh, Karozi, I, I mean, she's not afraid of you, but she no. is trying to think how much the sword would affect her. Uh, would sword turn into gun? Technically, no, I'm no, half. No, no, no. She's more wondering if... Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. Because she thinks she's a piece of shit, so like... She's like, a huh, am I devil. evil enough that this is gonna hurt me? Yeah. Well, I, I feel I mean, like... Yeah, the sword. <laughs> since the sword always glows at least five feet in bright light, we you were within five feet of me before. Did it hurt you? Or did it, did it hurt Glee? No. All right, cool. I don't know that. I don't know it's supposed to hurt from that distance. <laughs> Why don't you just get closer? I don't know that it, it would do that. Come on, let's just push it closer. Why, do you want me to touch it? Yeah, go touch it. L lick it. Why don't It'll be funny. It. Okay. All right, I'll touch it. Can I touch the sword? What? Um... That's a very weird request, I'm not gonna lie, but sure. Yay! Oh. Your hand blows off, no. <laughs> you touch the sword and you just hear a voice in your head? No. Smash. Did the sword say no? Or did the sword say no to me? Or Yes, the sword told you no. Mr. Sword, why are we saying no? Don't touch me. Oh. Genocide sword. Genocide sword. Genocide sword. <laughs> Does Ari hear this? Let me look. I think it's probably mental. Okay. But I will confirm just so. Oh, uh, no, it's emotional. You get the emotional now, Glee. Bad vibes. What do you, uh... You get an emotional middle finger. <laughs> you get emotional damage. Would he feel better if I, uh... If I told him, you know... If I told him I'd clean him? He is not dirty. He feels insulted. Do you believe? It's not dirty. No, no, no. He means like. No, no, no. I mean like. I mean like. Cast prestidigitation. I'm sure the searing divine light around it probably yeah. burnt off all the blood and ichor. Yeah, yeah but really? that, but it's like it's like you know giving it a nice shine, you know. You're saying the source. I know it's. I know it's. It I know it. <laughs> Keep digging the hole, really Buckaroo. That happened when you press and digitate it. It was already so beautiful. Perfect, even. Sublime. So, your sword's a. Uh... He's a little, he's a little, um, B, it, they, delicate. I think his pronouns are very slash sharp. Very no, no, slash they, sharp. It's they slash them. <laughs> oh my fucking God. That's much better. Title, title, let's go. Slash them. The emotion that Glee gets, just the red X. Uh, 
Well, I, I think show and tell's over now, and she'll sheath the sword behind her. Okay. I mm, no, she'll do it later. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Mm -hmm. Do it now. Do it. Do it. Uh, okay. Uh, she's gonna te cast detect thoughts and see if she can detect the thoughts of the sword. Genocide. Genocide. You Genocide. get a very content feeling from the sword now that it is sheathed. But no, it like, surface it's, thoughts. It's not like a full formed. <laughs> yeah, it's not an intelligent reality. All right. Quite. Well. Um, not as smart as Mice's shield. <laughs> you yeah, get the thoughts off the shield. Yeah. Thing's a dummy compared to the shield. <laughs> I'd love to know what he's thinking. He doesn't talk much. Oh, true. I mean, it has a 10 intelligence, a 20 wisdom, and 18 charisma, so it just can't be that bad. Okay, yeah, I guess it is it's an intelligence. a really likable idiot. <laughs> a himbo. <laughs> oh my god, you have a himbo sword. Himbo sword. Himbo yeah. sword. Himbo sword. <laughs> it's a really thin dare himbo sword. <laughs> It just likes to be held by one person at a time. It's fine. So it's a himbo simp. Yeah. No, it's a Sundar. It's a Sundar. Sundar, yeah. All right. What's the play? Where would you like to go? Uh oh, we done the hell. Can we take us to the map? Oh yeah, I, I suppose I could put you back on the map. No, stare at this blank screen. Okay, I go over here. It'll be funny. Ugh. Not over there. That's where the trap is. Okay. reference okay i should put myself on the map as well so that i can reference where you're at you are where's core there's no core on the map anymore we'll use ari instead you are right here ish great I actually forget exactly what we're getting. <laughs> um, I know we, we we went to go get the sword. That was the main thing. All right. So you have the sword. You have the sword now. The things I guess that are to wherever Zariel is, right? The, the things that are still on your to-do list. Redeem Zariel. Kill the bad sides of. Um, Mirth, Mirth, if you want to do that still. Uh, Potentially go fuck up Bell because Bell has Mice's dad. Return El Terrell to the material plane. Can we Crack open the companion Bell? like an egg. Egg. Those are the to-do lists that I understand you all to have. So... so okay, killing the bad parts of Mirth do we do that f before a attempting the the takeover from Asmodeus or no? Probably yes. before. Okay. You definitely want to do that before. Yeah. If you don't do that before you fight Asmodeus, all of him will become a god. Okay, cool. That's what I thought, but yeah. I just wanted to make sure that that we that that was the <laughs> right thing. So, I think we do since we have the sword now, I think we do Bell Ooh, I know this is going to sound clock, like... But you don't know how long that clock is. I... I... I okay. I know this is going to sound... Weird. Should we go return to Lanthius... Atlantheus's hand? What? 
He told you just to destroy it, and he'd probably. Oh, okay, all right. We could just. Yeah, could, yeah. Could you? Yeah, could you? Could you? All right. Could you do the thing? Just whack it. Um. I'll toss it in our fire. That sounds like a good idea. All right. You quickly destroy the hand in a way that we don't describe. I mean, because we don't need to do that. Oh, I can just. Eldritch Blast it. Blow it up that way. Yeah, but, you know, holy. It's cool. You have a cool that's sword. That's like the way that's most likely to destroy it permanently. <laughs> ah, it's fine. I really wouldn't want to hurt somebody that's been so nice to us. Even though it's just his hand and just grow back, but... Didn't he attack us? It was more of a test. Yeah, he challenged us. We didn't have to accept. If I recall, he almost killed us. No, I mean he, he just he just I think we he just made sure that we were we were worthy. Of course, then there was like four HP left. I should Literally. say that in more fights I get in. <laughs> Not that I really care, but Bell will probably have a issue with how I am now, and I hope you all are okay with that. Why would we be upset about it? It just might not be an easy conversation now. Ah, that's no big deal. Okay. I don't really care what he thinks. I mean, agree. We should rescue your father. And your your hot boyfriend. He's not my boyfriend. Alright, I forgot about that there was <laughs> someone else. Uh, we can always head back to the Traveling Bazaar, or at least try to find it. Do we still have our imp? Where's our car? <laughs> Where's our car? Better question. Oh, 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 your car. It's there in the corner, gleaming brightly. Uh, right, it, because we it figured it out. It doesn't take radiant damage. I mean, it couldn't. It couldn't go. It couldn't go near the scar. It couldn't go uh, beyond yes. the scar. So. You could not climb the scar in your mm -hmm. car, so the car Come is sitting go. there, just vibing. Oh no, the dretches! The dretches are stealing the car! I can't believe the dretches stole her fucking car. <laughs> they can't figure out how to drive it. Um, no, your car is right there. Uh, it's fine, and I think it has an imp in it. Yeah, which one are we on now? God, I don't, don't ask me that. I believe this is the fourth. That's <laughs> four? Four. Yeah. I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. Alright, so I'm hearing Bazaar and Bell. I think that should be our first step, and yep. then after that we go to um Mirth and them. I do have a way to summon Malice, by the way. Did you want to do that now? No, I was just... Just informing people that we have a way to at least find one of the two... Three bad sides. Well, we know where one is, but we probably can't get to it because it's in the companion. Part of Malaise is in the companion, yes. Guys, hear me out. We go to Bell. We we act all big and tough, right? Then we're like, well, you don't just have to be afraid of us. Summon Malice and make them fight each other. <laughs> 
and then we kill whoever's still alive. Let Probably them false. fight. That could also backfire exactly. where she goes, haha, fuck you, no, and they both no, fight no. us. No, no, this is great. This is perfect. There's nothing wrong with this plan. <laughs> Let them fight. Yeah, huh? you could, um... Of what that. I... <laughs> of what I know of Malice, she probably wouldn't even waste her time with Belle. Which makes me wonder why we're trying to fight her. For the greater good, of course. So that's why we're doing it. I was gonna do it because she's a bitch. I mean, yes, she took a lot from me, but... I mean, people can change... She give her a chance to repent if she's willing to repent. Her name's Malice. I don't think she's gonna. I mean, that's that's a fair observation. But we should still give her the chance. And if not, then, you know, we'll act accordingly. You're the one she fucked over. This is true. Well, that's a tomorrow issue. We should definitely either go to the bazaar if we need to stock up or get more supplies or go straight to Bell and uh, rescue uh, the people there. I think I'm supposed to get another gun. Don't sound so sad about it. I'm elated. Don't sound so sad about it. <laughs> I haven't had much practice in talking or being happy. Well, both of those can be practiced easily. Right. Nowhere better to practice than hell. I mean, we're here. Mm. All right, you have this lovely conversation. As you head off towards the bazaar. You find it pretty easily. It is relatively close by. As you approach, things seem different here. It is as if Mahiti is throwing some kind of celebration. Heck yeah. Which Festival means episode! There are a lot of devils about buying, selling, celebrating. Festival episode. That, you know what, guys? We didn't, we never got our beach episode. What do you mean? Which we game? Never you got never, a beach you're episode. right, we never did get a beach episode. We never got a beach episode. That's true, we Her have never had a beach episode. Falling in the river. We've had balls. We've never had a beach episode. You are right. There's Time no for episode. some beaches. <laughs> yeah, we've had the wrong type of beaches. <laughs> Maybe the beach episode was when Ari was being one. <laughs> Hundred percent. Fair enough.
The devils that see you as you approach the bazaar, unless you decide you want to avoid it with the so many people around, give you a wide berth. They are... Wow. <laughs> kind of like, hmm, I don't know about these people, but they can tell that they shouldn't fuck with you. We have a literal, like, angel with us, of course. <laughs> No, they don't. You do see a couple monkeys. They're just vibing. You don't trust them. Yeah, they all just see, like, an icon over our heads. Fight them. I mean, I we're literally circle. walking with, like, an angel. Like... <laughs> Are these the same monkeys from the fight? Roll an insight. I don't know, they look alive, so probably not. <laughs> now tell me if this works. If I just put my hand on the hilt of my sword, do I get advantage on insight checks? This is while holding the sword. Or would it be sheathed on my back considered holding? Uh, you can have advantage. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, I wouldn't recommend drawing your weapon, but oh, you can yeah. have advantage. Okay. <laughs> These monkeys, 19. Uh, seem like they are scared of you. Very scared of you. And one looks a little hurt. She'll walk up to him with her hands out, like, you know, mean no harm. No hard feelings, right? They just kind of nod. What's going on here? Is there some party going on? What What are y'all celebrating? They kind of shrug. They just got here. <laughs> well, that's fair. That they they were pretty fast, you know. We if they got here before us in, in a car, they know the secret ways. Ah, yes, our imp has failed us. Can we get one of the monkeys as like a chauffeur? Oh, that'd be funny. Take us the oh secret ways. <laughs> it'd be like Mario. It'd be like Mario Kart. We'd have we've Donkey Kong. <laughs> Oh my Do you try God. to prop possession a monkey into <laughs> no. your chauffeur? <laughs> no. Donkey Kong chauffeur! Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong. <laughs> Demon Donkey Kong. Oh, well, um... Like I said, no hard feelings. Uh, I mean no harm to you. And, uh, I... Enjoy your time here. Um, I won't bother you anymore. Bye bye. They tell you bye, and then they look like they're gonna go sh split one of those uh, worm people uh. as a snack. Well, they seem nice. Eric has a collection of dretches outside of his tent who he's teaching how to shoot guns. Derek does? Yeah. He's empowering the dretches. My gun done. Is your payment done? I forgot how much it was. I'm just fucking with you. Mahidi paid for it. He has the gun. Mahidi paid for it? Yeah. Why? Didn't ask. Uh, yeah, yeah. He, he bops one of the dretches on the head. Do not aim it at your friends. You... Well, that oh. takes care of the gun. Kind of concerning, though, that... Can I he... get some supplies for bullets? Sure, how much you need. 
Uh, trying to remember. Probably like enough to make 50. Okay. Uh, scrap metal. Where is the gun paperwork? It's been too long since we've gunned. Ammo costs. Pistol ammo? Uh... Two gold per 20, so four and a half gold. All right, yep, I just pay him. Yep. I believe that you do that. I lied. Oh, no, no, not the four gold in hell. <laughs> um, how much again were some of those specialty bullets? Right. Um, Wandering Emporium. The elemental charms are 300 gold apiece. They take up one of your bullet slots, but change the damage type to... Currently, fire, necrotic, thunder, cold, poison, or lightning. You can switch them out on reloads. What do you guys think? Do you think that could be worth it? How much gold? 300. 300? Per charm. Per could charm. Could you have a lot of gems and stuff? Yep. Where Do we have a bag that says all of our money? Yes, it does. Money, bitch. Holding all this shit. Yeah. We have six long swords, six chain shirts, one great sword, <laughs> two half plates. Well, Should like we sell this. those? <laughs> Don't forget yes. the twelve scimitars we have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. We use some of that because we use a lot of scrap metal for one carozzi. And to the car. Okay, the we can car. sell like the swords and shit, but we can keep the chain mill and like the half plate for scrap metal. Yeah. Yep. Uh, I'm twelve gonna... scimitars. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna just tell you now. Uh, the fire lizards offer you basically half price for everything. So whatever you could buy it for, they will give you half. Just to speed up looking for all of those items. Yeah. They yeah, will not like haggle with you. They will default laugh fifth at you. edition stuff. Yeah. yeah. Uh, twelve. So you for the scimitars you get twelve at twelve point five. Um. Oh. So I think it's worth it. But which one do you think would be? The best. Maybe lightning? I don't think a lot of demons or devils have resistance to lightning, right? No, I, th I think lightning would be a good a good. I think pack. lightning would be fine. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, so. so, demons are generally not resistant to, like, fire and cold. There are some, but they're not, it's not, it's devils that are, like... Yeah, but we're gonna be fighting, we're fighting both. both. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, I know we're fighting both. I'm just letting you know. I'm when tech yeah. we fight very few demons. Mm -hmm. okay. I mean, we just fought a literal fuck ton of them. Yeah. Yeah, I but think they were baby. Lightning should be a relatively safe one, though, right? Yep. All right, I'll buy the lightning one. Uh, I'm gonna take it out of the bag of holding all this shit. Are you keeping the half plates to use for... I think we're keeping the chain shirts and the half plates. Okay. Um, then everything else, I think, should come to, uh... 12, 220. 220, yeah. Gold? Yep, gold. Okay. I updated it for the amount that I took to pay for the thing. Just like the straight gold. 
All right, I'm going to put the uh Yeah, I think I'm going to put the electric one in my normal pistol. Okay. Well, actually, I'll hold on. I'll wait and see what the about the new gun. Guess while we're at the lizards, we can collect the stuff that we had commissioned. True. What did we have commissioned? I don't remember. As your guess is good. Uh, it was. It was armor. That was made from. The dragon. The stick dragon. Dragon scales. Yes. Mm. And then I believe two daggers made out of the, the stick dragon claws. Yeah, because I still have the teeth in my inventory. Teeth. The teeth. All right. How the claws daggers work is they both do 1d4 plus 1d4 lightning. If you hit with both of them in a turn, they also do an additional 2d8 lightning. But only if you hit with both. Well, that's awkward, because I was going to give... <laughs> keep one and give one away. But that's fine. Who wants to switch exclusively to daggers? <laughs> Who wants to go, monk? <laughs> Hear me out. We take core. We just tape a bunch of daggers around her. <laughs> and I am not over. a throwable object. <laughs> I mean, you don't even have to be throwable. It's just a to make sure star. you don't get eaten. It's that sounds just like coke, to make Jamie. It is a protective quills to help you not get eaten. I'm going to be honest. I don't remember what the Styx Dragon armor does. I think it's the equivalent of uh, Dragon Scale Mail of Lightning. I think that's what you said, too. It had some sort of resistance on it. Uh, if someone like wants to look it up, to you river. can definitely do so. Otherwise, for now, we're going to say uh, equivalent Wait. of a lightning dragon scale male. No, Maybe hold up. Is. No, it was the... I remember now. It was the beetle carapace because y'all made the joke about making like a matching hat with its pincers. <laughs> the that was a beetle thing. carapace, I, I believe, has resistance to... Piercing and slashing, but vulnerability to bludgeoning. Or is that not what it was? I don't remember. Because I Gosh, think we wild. gave all the scales to Basilstein for getting our car out. However, regardless of which armor it is, I believe it is a beetle now that you've talked about it. Yeah. Uh, the lizards say Mahiti has it. Of course. Why did Mahiti buy all our shit? I wonder. Well, those are already uh, bought for, so we traded those fair, and I don't know why he has our stuff. It Sounds like feels he's... like he wants us to meet with him. <sighs> he's cruising for a bruising, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. We'll see. I don't want to fight what? Mahiti. He's chill. Think about how well he took us killing his girlfriend. As in we like, haven't addressed it at all. I know you killed his girlfriend. What'd you say? I don't know if he still... I still don't think he knows that. Nope. I, I don't think we no. know if he knows that we killed... He, well, technically we didn't, and that's what we told him. Mm -hmm. the, the she did people, die. We were people there. Her yeah, we did tell... We, we, tell, we told him that he, she got run over by a car that her own people... He hit. did make a slight jab at us at one point. He did. Bye, reindeer. <laughs> yeah, that did that. Uh, Glee, did you need any more of those red rocks? Yeah, I was gonna go buy some some rocks. Normally, you would not be able to find such rocks here. However. With the celebration that seems to be going on, there does appear to be a couple jewelers. 
I would like to acquire red rock. You buy red rock. All right. I have 1,500 gold worth of red rock. I would like to now take my red rock to the salamanders and ask them to turn it into dust. You'll hit this with the hammer, please. They, they, they will hit it. Since you've been such good hammer, such good loyal customers, they will hit it for you for just five gold. Nice. I give them the five gold. All right, they will hit your pretty rock. It's more like rocks, but yeah. They crush it into uh, pop rocks. Feel free to snort it. All right. And that's it. Mitty also magically has the red rock dust now as well. And they give it directly to me. No. Son of no. a bitch. <laughs> he doesn't have that. <laughs> what is happening? Mahiti Scent is surrounded by a long line of people who are interested to get in for dinner. Uh, is there anything else you would like to buy? Uh, not at this time. Is this where the item that we were talking about comes into play, or is that like a different thing altogether? Uh, I was not suggesting you shop for those items. Okay. Where's our bespoke item? Where is it? I just it? didn't want to like miss it by saying no. <laughs> no, I get you. All right. Is there any vendor that's usually not here other than the jeweler? Any cool knickknacks? Yeah, there's a couple cool knickknack shops. What kind of knickknack you want? Oh, I don't know. But I do have wizard books that I probably should change into scrolls if that's still a thing I can do. Yeah, there is someone who can do that for you. For a reasonable price of a full well, is it some, cost, because something it's something that I can do, right? Because because I did it before. Yes, it is something you can do. I don't know where the rules for that are. Or um, should we just sell the books intact? I think so. Just, you know, I don't have a use for them unless we want to break them to scrolls and use them, but and this is a fire scroll book. Fire spell book. Don't think it's going to give us much use. Hmm. So, don't know where that roll, that roll set is at this point in time. I've got to be honest. I'm sorry. That's fine. I will just see if somebody would oh, like to... Oh, I did to... found it. If you uh... want to. Um, do we just sell it? Yeah, let's just sell it. I mean, to be completely honest, we're really not going to spend that much money on, like, probably most anything else. Hmm. Like, we're flush with cash right now, and... If we're not planning on getting anything soon, I don't know how much we really need. Can I can I ask if I can buy potions? Oh, potions probably a good idea. What kind of potions? Healing potions. You can buy healing potions. Yeah. You can even ask. They are double the cost that they normally would be. Uh, how much money do we have? A lot. How much is a healing potion? A he the healing potions potion of healing. Let's see. Uh, how 
Oh my god, they are so expensive then. Uh, greater healing. How much are you? You are uncommon, so therefore, 100 to 500. How much are they? Uh, which one are you wanting? Greater healing. Greater. Which are uncommon? They're 500. 500? All right. Uh, it's just not worth it. Yeah, it's not worth it. It just don't die, man. I say as the resident basketball. I don't know. I mean, I kind of think it's worth it. Do you guys Again. have any potions at all? No. Um, I don't think I do. Let me check. I do not. Uh, wait, actually. Uh, no, I think I used it. Because I knew I used oh, it. I have, I have one. 35,000 gold Holy shit. for selling Fanor's spellbook. Oh. Holy wait, do we actually sell shit. that book? No, it's still in our inventory. If you want to sell it, that is what the vendor will give you for it. How about the fire spell book? I don't have that list in front of me. Do you have it on your spell sheet on your character sheet? I do. These are the spells that are in there. Oh no, there's not levels attached to them. Ah. I'm sorry, that's what I, you gave me. No, it's not your fault. It's my own fault. I shot myself <laughs> in the foot. It goes, it goes in order. It goes in order. Uh Burning Hands one. Here, I'll I'll Type it in. Ew. <laughs> oh. Oh, jeez. Okay. Let me go to Notepad real quick. I got you covered. All right. So one, two, 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 three, 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 four, four, five. The all fire, you would get thirty six hundred. Dang. Between the two of them, you would get forty thousand fucking gold, or more accurately, four thousand platinum, because that's easier to carry.
We're rich. We were already rich. We're filthy, rich. stinking rich. But I guess selling the books might be a good idea and getting some health potions for everybody. So much cash. The I mean, we can't be... use the book. Yeah. The Basically, only, the, the only are... expensive that they can be is what the, the only spells. Be. Okay, so like time stop, I believe Core could use, and teleport is pretty good. Like if somebody made it into a scroll, they can use it. Yeah. But then they still have to roll to um cast it. To cast it. They would be high DC. Because well. What they stop are. is also like a big chunk of the cash. Yeah, it's yeah. probably the most the probably the most rare thing on there. Yeah, the the time stop is literally three fourths of the cash you would be getting for a single cast of it, essentially. Which means if there are any of the lower level ones that you want to have as a scroll, you could cut those out relatively easily and still get good cash. But <laughs> that's what that is. That it do be. So okay. Guys, how do we want to handle it? We want to just sell the book? I honestly think it's more worth it to sell the book. Yep, I think so too. We haven't used it and we've had it for a literal out game months, so we should probably just sell it. <laughs> we'll forget about it again if we don't, so. All right, you are handed fat stacks of cash. Thanks. Nice. In exchange for one stinky book. We should definitely, I think, get the health potions. <laughs> and I guess we sell the fire book as well, even though, or is that part of this transaction? It is up to you. The first one is 34,500. Second one is 3,600. You might as well sell it, too. I don't foresee you finding an instance when you'd want to use the spells in it, so... Yeah, yeah. I'll sell it. Okay. You walk away with a lot of money. Which you can turn into health potions! Wow! How many health potions would you like? I mean, we could buy two each and still not even like make Put a, a dent, dent into in what we just got. I think that's a good idea. So I think that's 10,000 gold because there's five of us, 500 I have, per. I have one potion of healing already. This would be a greater. Yeah. yeah. And spend 10,000 and get 10 graders pretty easily. They are out of graders now. You would have to choose a different <laughs> level. Does that sound good for everybody? Yep. Yeah, sounds great. Sure. Potion okay. of greater Is not in the compendium because we don't have that because we don't have the dungeon master's guide. Never mind. Scree. Uh, oh. just gonna pull out a potion of healing, change it to greater, and just know it's forty-four plus four. I would go higher, but it goes. 
goes into rare, and that, like, rare is a lot. Mm -hmm. Yep. I could say that, yeah. Do we have a diamond for Revivify? I don't know. Uh, I know that I don't. But I Does sure anyone have. have the spell Revivify? Yeah, I do. So this glue, yep. I think. Yeah. I have a, I have a, I have a diamond for Revivify. I've been holding, I've been hoarding it. Where did you get that? <laughs> I'll never tell. <laughs> I could have sworn I got you one. Buying that in hell. <laughs> I thought we had one for the longest time, and I tried to use it, but it didn't work on the... Oh, wait, you know what? It would have been used. Yeah. I thought it was already dead, so you couldn't even target it. Yeah. Oh, right, yeah. That was also a thing. It's been a... Did I use it somewhere else? <laughs> eh, you know what? Fuck it. I'll try to buy some diamonds. I'll buy three. All right, you buy three diamonds. <laughs> wow, diamonds, dude. Diamond hands. 900 gold. No, wait. 300 GP. Uh, diamond. Dust? No, I think it's Is it supposed dust? to be. It's supposed to be not dust. Is it not dust? It's just diamond? It's a diamond, I think. Cause... It's diamond's worth. Diamonds. So it, so could, it could be, be dust. diamond dust, technically? You know what? Fair enough. What is I dust? I don't know if there's any reason to dust diamond. it. All that glitters is diamond. Oh. Alright. Cool. I guess let's go talk to Mahiti and see what the fuck is going on. Hey, dude, what's going on, dude? Um, there's a line, right? To get in? Right, yeah, there's a line. I'm gonna get yeah, behind. Right I want to cause more of a scene than I already am. <laughs> hey, dude, totally yeah, not waiting. serial is here waiting. to talk to you. Alright, you all get in line. After about five minutes, what looks like a bouncer comes and sees you in line and pulls you all out of line to go directly to talk to Mahiti. What? What a kind person. Guess Excuse me, we have, special, we have special, we have special, uh, privileges, special privileges. Uh, excuse me, peasants. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yes, yes, you yes. do get flipped off by a number of devils as you walk past the line. Um, but none of them want to fight the bouncer and you, because that would be idiotic. That would be stupid. You all are led into Mahiti's uh, personal restaurant once more. It is crackling with energy. They lead you down a hallway you've never been down before until you are in Mahiti's personal dining room. Mahiti is sitting at the head of the table. There are already dinners being set out for you all, and he gives you all the widest smile. and says, ah, I was hoping you all would show up soon. Come, sit. All right. Sit down. What's the occasion? I hear you've been successful in a big part of your journey. I look so I over at Ari. Oh, sorry, go ahead. 
I just thought we'd celebrate. Why do you care? Because it is always so exciting to th see things getting shaken up in our little patch of paradise. Indeed. I know I look forward to the potential restoration to its former glory. Here in Avernus. Former glory? What do you mean? Before, Avernus was this desolate wasteland. It was beautiful, luxurious. It was the most tempting and delightful palace of pleasure. Spas, resorts, everything a cultured man might desire. And since then, it has been turned into a bloody battlefield. I would have it returned to the way, the way it was before. If we could beat back the demons just a little bit, we could at least partially re re invigorate the land. Uh -huh. So it's been like this since the Eternal Blood War? Well, I mean, the Blood War has been forever, but... The blood war being fought on Avernus is a little bit less than that. I see. The point being, the front lines doesn't have to be here. If there was better leadership. Uh -huh. Who? Well, it sounds like, from what I hear, it might not be Zariel for much longer. Who'd you hear this from, by chance? You could say a little imp told me. Hmm. Little imp. Y yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. That tracks. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds about cut, right. Cut to later, and we're giving the fucking imp a swirly. He snitched. And hey, you a snitch, huh? Snitch. Another little imp has told me that you also might have some beef with Bell, which leaves such a wonderful little power gap. Don't you think? Anyway, I have gifts. Thank you. For you. This tall knight in shining black armor. I've decided that perhaps you might like something else. I thought the nice. gift was a tall knight in black <laughs> armor. I'm like, you're just giving this, okay? Mm -hmm. Mice, you know, again. There you go. There you go, mice. A man. <laughs> mice, you finally got a man. <laughs> uh, mice, he offers you silver plus two plate armor. Wow. Mm. That's uh, a lot. No one will ever touch him again. 
Uh, for our equally tall but slightly less shiny armor, your leathers are a bit dingy, my dear. Uh, girl in the cowboy hat, I helped pay off the rest of your gun. Um, for Karosi, he offers you an arcane cannon. Like a cannonball gun? Or like a cannon? Not the, not the cannons. It is uh, not exactly what you might have meant when you wanted a gun. But it is a pretty cool item, I think. What's it called? Arcane Cannon. It is not large as it is listed. It is a looks like a little pistol. Oh, uh, she takes it and looks it over, nodding approvingly. For you, my dear little one. I thought that these robes would look quite good on you. I think they fit your aesthetic as you can see the stars in your eyes. For Kor, he offers you a robe of stars. Woo! I'm sure that these something. have absolutely no, no downsides to taking. Nope. Glee, your mother has been a loyal customer for many years, and I appreciate the beginning of your patron as well. And he offers you a staff of power. Yay, a stick! Yes, it is just a stick, actually. I like the four. That would entertain him. <laughs> And for Starts you, twirling it like a baton. My angelic friend. Here is uh, your armor that you've already paid for. Um, but additionally, I have uh, this for you. It is a beautiful crystalline shield that is a plus two shield. And it would require you to go down to one-handed for your weapon, but it would work with everything else. Or you could just carry it around to look pretty. Betcha. All I ask in return is that you consider me when you leave this massive hole in our power structure. I don't know why we'd have a say in it. Oh fuck, this thing does a lot. Really? You don't have anyone in mind that you're trying to set up to rule? Were you just planning on leaving a void here? Most likely. Wow, that is a terrible plan. <laughs> Every, we weren't, gonna, silently. We weren't uh, going yeah. to stay <laughs> for the aftermath. Huh. Well get yours I suppose we have our purposes here thank you you're welcome I charge and you do a better job than both Zeriel and Bell only time would tell corpses don't do great so. ruling Can I do an insight check on him? Sure. I'll just do a normal. I won't do advantage. We have to trust him. His name begins with the letter M. 
<laughs> I can't believe Mahiti was the last asp. <laughs> ah, yes, the emotions. Misery, malice, M- Mahiti. Mahiti and M- Maybelline, like, fuck. Ari, um... You can't tell what his intentions are with this, but he does do a good job rolling his slice of paradise here with the bazaar. He is probably quite confident in his own ability. Certainly Donald Trump would be a great president. He's good with business. (laughs) Fuck. (laughs) I was drinking water. I'm glad my mic was muted. Sorry. It's just like, like, oh shit. It's just that. Uh, Let's eat dinner. Let's eat grandpa. No, it is a pleasant (laughs) earthen or even material plane in it's steak it's just a bunch of steaks normal cow steak try not to be excited fail Steak and good armor. What more could a paladin want? Steak armor. No, that would be bad. Oh, yeah. That's magic missile now. Wait, so the plus two shield is additional plus four AC? Mm-hmm. Yes, you just have to shield hold it. Yeah. If you want to use it, it is a choice, but you also have the sword of Zarel, so I don't mind. (laughs) That's fair. (laughs) You also have the sword that makes you fucking ridiculous, so you know, it's I think it evens out just a little bit. I mean, it's somewhere in there, it's fine. I'm just thinking, I need this armor. You also don't have to make, like, a permanent choice. Donning and doffing a shield is only an action. You can one day decide you're going into a fight without the shield, and the next day decide you're going in with the shield. Yeah. Per fight can scenario. Le- can I have less HP and get to get a Warcaster? Are you asking to change your last level up? Well, I mean, it would have been two levels ago, but yeah. <laughs> gonna I say no. Two levels ago, because I just got an item. That's fine. All right, buddy. That's fine. Uh, does this turn it off? It doesn't. But yeah, um. You all are offered bribes by Mahiti. And this is where we will end session for the night. Um, Let me know if there's anything else reasonable that would reasonably be at a big celebration at his thing if you want to buy more items. And let me know if you want to have any more conversations with Mahiti now that he has bribed you. Kor gets accidentally drunk. Smile. Kor gets <laughs> slammed. The fuck? Oh dear, she didn't realize how much... Oh, These dear. are bribes. They are bribes. Is it a gift or is it a bribe? Uh, well, there was... It's he, a bribe if they expect something of you for it. He just strongly implied it. 
smile. I mean, we didn't I sign any no contracts. Plans. That's the important part. Yeah, I mean, I had absolutely no plans for who would take over. I yeah, didn't I think, think we'd be involved in it. So I think the fact that we just don't give a shit. If we are, <laughs> then the drive worked. Yikes. Think of me whenever you decide who's gonna take over this place. We aren't. Thanks. Whenever we what? <laughs> whenever All of you to we assume what? we're gonna have a choice. Whenever we think, maybe we will. Think. I don't remember yeah, having a plan. Do you guys remember having a plan? I don't remember I having a plan. Didn't think we would be having the choice. Mahini might have thought you guys had more of a plan to your madness than you actually fucking do. Uh, I mean, like did you I said, imagine uh, getting to the end of the campaign? All right, now choose your new leader of Avernus. And then Mahini's in the background, like, Please. hey! Hi! We did I kill his remember. girlfriend, so. Yeah, he I didn't pick, care, though. I pick Mirth. What the fuck? No, because he's going to be a whole god. All right, like, I pick we... Bell. We... What the fuck? Yeah. We're going to probably kill Bell. I pick the reanimated corpse of Bell. <laughs> I pick myself. Bell again. I mean, <laughs> Mad Maggie. <laughs> He probably feels like we might have a, a few say in it since we're like probably the strongest warlord band that's roaming Avernus, just well, like, killing shit as we go. You along. are the strongest what warlord it, band right now. Wouldn't Asmodeus decide? I mean, we're too. supposed to be kicking his ass, so. Are we? Well, yeah, but then, like, that doesn't mean we get to decide. I don't know. Mahiti seems to think so. <laughs> I know, like I'm not gonna correct you on I, this. I, I <laughs> think it's crazy that we didn't think we'd be like choosing yeah. the person, but like, he's, yeah, he's also sufficiently bribed a little bit. Maybe he's like, "Wow, you're killing a lot of people. Don't kill please me, don't murder please." Me. Um, you could kill everyone here me. and Why? then take You've my. You've been nothing but so. cool with us. Yeah, even after we completely destroyed your car. <laughs> He doesn't know that. He didn't know that. Yes, he did. We, but we got it back for him. Yeah, we got it back for him because he's like, "Is that the car in the?" I'm lava? gonna let you in on a little secret. Y'all have not kept secrets from Mahiti. Nope. Because you have constantly taken imps with you. Yep. No, we are super secret, guys. No one knows what we're up to. We're like, <laughs> I, honestly, he knows if he's constantly spying on us. He should have freaking known that we don't have a plan. <laughs> yep. That we're just running around him. being like, let's go this way. Maybe this way now. Mm, that didn't work. Let's go this way. We dropped our oh, car to the rim. river station and we almost lost our fucking minds. <laughs> we are yeah, the masters he, of the He knows first. of the car jump. He knows Does, that. <laughs> could Ari potentially, like, like, Navigate through Avernus now? Um, I do not think that would be a benefit of the sword, as it is hell, and you are now more angelic. Okay, I just wasn't sure, because... You get super lost and stuff. Ari really doesn't want this imp with them anymore. <laughs> ah, who cares? No, well, you don't understand. Ari really doesn't want that <laughs> imp next to us. Oh my gosh, the imp just flies too close and it gets incinerated. <laughs> oh, like, wouldn't okay. it be like, be like technically like very uncomfortable being near oh, me? Oh yeah, constantly. Oh yeah, it hates, it, it stays in the back of the car now. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, I could always go mad and learn how to, how this place works. Somehow this is back on the table. I see. No, it's not. No, we'll, we'll keep the imp. Oh. Madness. What don't a worry, little if you ever madness. See, if you ever see something you really don't want Mahiti to know, you can just kill him. I know Celestial. Okay. I don't know if you can talk Celestial. I have a different idea. 
For what? Could I take the Staff of Power to the Salamanders and tell them, could you, could you combine this with my Rod of the Pact Keeper? Hello, Mr. DM. I wish to take duct tape my items together. Do you have the attunement slots to have them both? So here's the thing. <laughs> and that's where the issue is. No, 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 that's not the issue. It, it, here's the thing. I don't even mind you attuning to them both, right? The issue is that, like, I have to hold them both, but I need a free hand to cast. You can't cast through... Oh, no, because I guess you have to have the somatic parts. Yep. That's why I was like, I, I really want Warcaster now. But you can draw a focus as part of casting a thing, so... No, you, can't, you have to have a free hand when you cast. But if you have a... I don't think that's true. Because also means I wouldn't things. be able to cast spells if she used the shield. It is, it is very true. That's like the whole point of Warcaster. <coughs> I know everybody talks about the 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 concentration part, but e. Warcaster, you can perform the somatic uh, components of spells even when you have weapons or a sh weapons, weapons or a shield, shield in, in one or both hands. Mm -hmm. You can also just have your... I guess it's, it's different for arcane stuff. 